What's up, you YouTube? My name is Trevor from Shine Films, and I'm getting kind of pissed because this is my third time trying to make this really simple Sony Vegas tutorial, and I'm getting angry. But first thing you're going to do, oh wait, I need to tell you what we're doing. And what I, Trevor, am going to do is show you how to do picture in picture effect. But before we do that, I'd like to talk about something. Whenever you send me a message or leave me a comment and you want to say my name, do not say Trevor. I have decided that Trevor is no longer sufficient for my needs. It has become my slave name. And the reason why I say that is because every time people want me to do something, they refer to me as Trevor. And so I figure if I can just eliminate the whole Trevor scenario, then uh, I won't have a problem with having to do work anymore. I don't know. It seems logical in my mind. So what I have just done is I have dragged in two video clips so that we can make the picture in picture mode. Uh, one is a rev video of the exhaust note on an Aston Martin DBS, which is a supercar. Happens to be one of my favorite cars of all time. Now what I'm doing now is I'm just pressing S to trim up and delete part of the video that I do not want to watch. Uh, and I just burped. Um, got to do what you got to do. And this video is of an AC transit bus fight where this black guy gets whooped down on by this like senior citizen white guy. And uh, black guy said he was being racist. White guy said that he had hood brothers. So why would he need to be racist? And what I'm doing now is I'm just, oh, oh, boom, headshot, ah, look at that, look at that, okay, split, delete, drag back, all right, now what we're going, next step is we're going to make both the images widescreen so we can forget about the 4 by 3 you know, square aspect ratio, because no one likes that. That was when we still had analog TVs. Analog, can you believe that? That was like ages ago, wasn't it? I'm just kidding. I still have one in my house. Um, You want to right-click on whatever video you're trying to make widescreen, and then left-click on properties, and then hit the media tab, and uh, right here where it says pixel aspect ratio, you want to change it to NTC DV widescreen, if you are in the US of A or North America and uh, PAL DV widescreen which is right here if you are in Europe and um, if you live anywhere else like Africa or South America then I don't care about you no I'm just kidding I do care about you very much especially if you subscribe to me I'd care about you even more but I do not know what format they use or what format their television slash YouTube plays on we're just gonna do the same thing to this one up here God, dude, you guys gotta forgive me because my mouth is extremely dry. Because I've tried this video like 50, 11 times, and Camp Studio never wants to save it to my hard drive. But I was also asked a question on how do you get videos off of YouTube onto your computer? That will be what? No! 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 Um, I have taken time and I've watched a little bit of GT3 and I had time to meditate and I'm no longer angry at Sony and the corporation called Sony. Um, so let's get back to this video tutorial. Uh, so you open up Vegas yet again and um, what I was talking about earlier, I'll do in my next video, it's how I am able to get What I was talking about was how to get YouTube videos off of YouTube onto your computer. I will make that video probably later today or tomorrow and upload it, I don't know, from now. I mean, you guys live in YouTube and not at my house, so it's not in real time. So I don't even know why I'm bothering talking about it. Just know, it'll be my next video. Okay, guys, guess what it is. This is what I like to call audio overlap while fast forwarding because your video is too long okay done Woo! all right now what you want to do is uh you want to hit this event pan crop 
which is like it's like a square with bow ties on the corner and uh, you want to scroll out with your mouse pad so that it makes the picture big and you want to click and drag the corner of the little video frame up to four sections you see section one two three four you want to what you, it can be any size you want to just make sure that it's even because if it's uneven it's unprofessional and it looks crappy to be honest with you and if I see that and you say hey shine films told me how to do this I'm gonna leave nasty trolliocious comments on your page okay so that's just how it goes um so that's how you do the picture and picture effect it's done now if you want the bottom frame to be a picture and picture also then you want to hit the little bow tie box again and make it the same size you did the other video you can make it bigger, but like I said before, it looked crappy. Um, and you want to move this whole frame somewhere else so that it lines up. So now let's play it, and I'll put my mic next to my speaker so you can hear the audio. <laughs> y'all, y'all heard that black girl's verse <laughs> voice. Ah, what the. <laughs> you can hear it over the exhaust. She had a loud mouth. So uh, that's how you do it. And any other questions, leave them in the comments. I'll get to them. And uh, anything else you want me to do for you, I will do it. Because YouTube and its people are my homies. <laughs>